Hi, my name is Pop. I'm making a video in Ubuntu Basics showing how to use one aspect of LibreOffice.org Impress, the presentation program. And in this video, I'm going to show how to place a video into Impress such that the video will continue to play across several slides. Normally, when you put in a video, it plays for the duration of one slide and then when you go to the next slide the video stops. This is a workaround and it's kind of klutzy but it does work. First thing I'm going to do is open up Impress and I'm going to open up a blank presentation and this blank presentation is just a white screen. After you create it you need to do one thing I always forget to do it and that's to go to page and change the page so that it's 16 by 9. I also like to have something in color. I'm kind of stuck in this light cyan mode right now. I'm going to be putting my video that spans across all of the slides, I think up here in the top left. For that reason, I'm going to move the text and the title so that they are elsewhere on the screen. But before doing so, I am going to I'm going to look at um, where are my headers and footers. They put it in view. I think it should be an insert. Slide number apply to all. So this is slide one, my one and only slide. And down here you can barely see it now, but it says slide one. Now on my title, I've got a click and I'm going to, I've got the hand now, so left click and, oops, I lost it. I've got the hand, left click and move it down. I've got the arrow, I'll go about halfway up. Over here in the text, I need to also move this halfway across. I'm not doing this precisely. I'm doing it fast and dirty for the presentation here. Okay, this is, I'm going to call this my final format even though it's not cleanly done. And now I'm going to insert, duplicate, insert, duplicate. I've got three slides now. This says I'm slide three. It's changed to slide two. Now I'm up here in slide one. Right here now I'm going to insert the hyperlink of the movie. I'm picking a movie that I happen to know is 16 by 9. And I'll just move the hyperlink up here. Now, when I tap on that, the movie starts. If I tap on it right now, the movie will start right now. But I want it to occur only when I have got the full screen presentation going. So hit, let me hit F5 and you'll see the full screen presentation. Down in the bottom right you can see that I'm in slide 1 and when I hit page down now I'm in slide 2 but see the hyperlink has vanished. 
page down again slide three page up page up now I'm in only the first slide when I tap on this hyperlink the movie will start now here's a problem you have to fuss with this you have to fuss with a lot of stuff since this is a workaround the movie will play but then when you hit slide two it might vanish because it's not quote always on top let's see this and let's try this and see what happens well I see the movie uh, I'm going to format it so that it is exactly one quarter of the screen by going control alt 7 and then I'm going to do control H to get rid of this text I still got the blue border and I have a prior video that shows how to get rid of that blue border with compass I've got the movie running and I'm in slide one as you can see if I go page down ah it works well I could have text up here and text down here that varies from slide to slide to slide and I can have audio that uh, I am narrating that goes from slide to slide to slide or just one slide you can put in a chart and a spreadsheet anything you want and as I say you can get rid of this blue border with compass with a, another technique now if you want of course with uh, control alt 4 you got half of a screen and that really makes a mess here so I don't recommend it now I'm in slide three and see I've lost everything you've got to be very careful it is a workaround and it doesn't work well but you can do it my name is pop I have a whole bunch of other YouTube videos in Ubuntu basics and spreadsheet basics and I thank you very much